Once upon a time, a long time ago, in a beautiful, magical kingdom, there lived a queen, and her name was Aloe Vera. But everyone called her Vera. Her mother named her after a beautiful, magical plant that grew that you could use it on your skin to make your skin beautiful and use it on your face. And if you had a little stomach ache, you could take the insides of it, mix it with something like water, and drink it. Now, Vera, she loved all of the animals, and she got along with everyone. She had a little boy, and she named him Asan. But Asan's nickname was Cheetah, and Cheetah just loved to dance when it got dark. And she would tell him some wonderful bedtime stories. She would tell him about their ancestors and how kind they were and everything that they did. But one thing, one story she did tell him is how they would hunt for beehives and they were very careful. And there was this one thing that she loved that the bees produce and it was called royal jelly. She would use it and she would take it to make her beautiful and make her strong and help her. It was called royal jelly and the bees made it especially for the queen bee. She would also tell him wonderful stories about the plants, about the universe, and she had a little animal and she raised him from when he was little and he would walk beside her all of the time and at night you would when you would see her you would see him and he was a very very kind animal now she would also tell cheetah stories about this great king that lived before they were born in a kingdom not so far away his name was king tut and she would tell him about the people that were with King Tut and the people that would help King Tut. They lived a beautiful life in harmony with everything. Now, as she was telling Cheetah these stories, Cheetah would fall asleep and he would dream he was in a magical place and he was running with the lions and they didn't hurt him and he was strong and he would get his strength from these lions that he would run with. He would also dream about the rhinos and how that they were his friends and they helped him. All of these wonderful things he would dream about. Now, he had a special pet. Now, this pet that he had was an elephant, but sometime as he was dreaming, he would wake up and open one eye and guess what who he would see he would see his mom standing there he knew he loved her now his rhino his name was sketch now he would dream that they were flying together now elephants don't really fly but cheetah would dream that his elephant was flying and they were going to all of these magical places and tasting all of these delicious fruits he would dream about eating purple bananas. Now, where they lived, purple bananas did grow. He would dream about his cheetah running around. He was eating all of these grapes, and everything was beautiful. Nothing harmed him, and they had a wonderful life. He would dream about his pet. Now, he dreamed his pet talked to him. <laughs> and and his little bird he would dream about them and how that they were just enjoying themselves well i tell you what it's getting late and i'm getting sleepy too <sighs> we'll talk about cheetah another day